Today we're going to set up a new project on CodeShip Basic using Bitbucket. So once I log into CodeShip, I'll see a blank dashboard like I do here. And then on Select Project in the top left, I will click Create New Project. From there, CodeShip will ask me to choose my source control, and I'm going to choose Bitbucket. CodeShip is going to ask me for my repository clone URL. Now over in my repo on Bitbucket, I can find that in the top right here. So we'll go ahead and copy this. I'll go back to CodeShip and I'll paste it in here. I click connect. And now CodeShip will ask me to choose between the basic or the pro infrastructure. Now the basic infrastructure is focused on easy to set up turnkey out of the box deployments. The pro infrastructure is focused on customizability and flexibility and power. Today we're going to go with the basic infrastructure, so I'll click on that. And then CodeShip will ask me for my setup commands and my test commands. Now my setup commands can be any commands I want, or CodeShip has a list of common commands for different languages. Let's say I just want to go with bundle install. And then for my test commands, I would enter any commands I want to have run as part of my test pipeline. Today we'll go ahead and skip that. So I'll click on save. And now I'm going to see my project dashboard. Now I'm going to go ahead and make a commit to my project so I can make sure it's working. Let's say testing code ship. And then I'll go ahead and push this up. And if we give it just a minute, we'll see my project is now started and I have a working code ship basic project using Bitbucket. 